Ah, well, those are some beautiful fish. Look at all the different colors. I... Wow! What is that thing? <laughs> okay, well, that scared me a little bit. Ugh, give me the heebie jeebies. Anyway, on Grogon 5, we don't have anything like that. So I had to get on the internet and do some research. Apparently, it's called a shark. Hmm, who knew? The first thing that surprised me about sharks is that they're fish. Can you believe it? Their entire skeleton is made out of something called cartilage. Cartilage is like a weird bendy material inside your body. Even you have cartilage. If you feel the end of your nose, well, not my nose, but your nose. See how it bends and moves around? That's because the end of your nose is made of cartilage. A shark's entire skeleton is made out of that stuff. That's pretty neat. The second thing that surprised me was that these things have been around for millions and millions of years. That means some of them were even alive at the same time as the dinosaurs. Whoa. Can you imagine a shark fighting a dinosaur? <laughs> Sharks live all over the place. Some live in deep water, some live in shallow water, some live near coral reefs, some live way out in the open ocean. They seem to be able to live almost anywhere, except they have to live in salt water. That means you won't find them in freshwater lakes or rivers. Well, except for river sharks which can be found in freshwater in Asia and Australia, and also bull sharks, which can switch between salt and freshwater and sometimes can be seen in tropical rivers. <sighs> Most sharks are carnivores, which means they eat meat and have really, really, really sharp teeth. And like, a lot more than I do. They have tons of tea. Hmm. Do you think the Tooth Fairy brings sharks money too? Hmm. Did you know that there are more than 400 different kinds of sharks? And they come in all kinds of different shapes and sizes. The smallest shark in the whole world is called the Dwarf Lantern Shark. Cool. It's small enough to fit inside your hand. They're not very big. The biggest shark is the whale shark. It can grow up to nearly 20 meters long. That's like, that's like one and a half school buses. Holy guacamole. Even though it's super huge, this shark only uses its giant mouth for gulping down plankton which are teeny tiny little creatures that live in the ocean. Let's take a look at some of my favorite sharks. Ooh, there's the Mako shark. It grows to be like four meters long and it's the fastest shark in the world. There are hammerhead sharks, which, well, I mean, look at it. Its head looks like a hammer. <laughs> what else can I say? The great white shark is probably the most famous of all the sharks. They grow to be up to six meters long. Whoa. I don't think I'd want to get into a fight with that guy. And my personal favorite, the goblin shark. Whoa. That is one 
weird looking dude. A lot of people are afraid of sharks, and I have to admit, they kind of freak me out too. But the truth is, shark attacks on people are very, very rare. In fact, shark attacks only kill around five people each year. So the chances of being attacked by a shark are really low. To compare, cows kill around 22 people a year. Even worse, mosquitoes kill thousands of people every year by spreading diseases. So if you want to be safe, uh, Wear bug spray? What am I talking about? Anyway, before I go, I have some shark jokes for you. <laughs> These ones are pretty funny. Okay, how did the hammerhead shark do on his math exam? <laughs> he nailed it! <laughs> what is a shark's favorite kind of sandwich? <laughs> Peanut butter and jellyfish! <laughs> Why did the shark cross the Great Barrier Reef? <laughs> to get to the other tide! <laughs> hey man. Do you remember to subscribe yet, man?